hi guys welcome to the session on metric beat introduction the agenda of the session is what is metric beat where metric beat fit in the data pipeline what is metric metric set and module we will talk about metric beat output and how metric beat works so let's begin our session metric beat is one of the beat of elastic beat family it is based on libbeat framework in previous sessions we already discussed one of the beat of elastic beat family that is file beat metric beat is used to monitor the system and its services technically we can say it is used as data shipper which sends the system metrics like cpu uses memory uses process details etc and service stats to the configured output it supports the multiple outputs like Elasticsearch, Logstash, Kafka, etc. Latest version of FileBeat is 8.8. .8. It can be used on multiple platforms like Windows, Linux, Mac means it supports the cross platform. This is basic detail about metric beat. Let's move further. Here you can see I have drawn one data pipeline just to give you an idea where the metric beat fit in in the data pipeline so here you can see metric beat metric beat is collecting the data from the system about cpu uses memory different metrics and then it would send those details in the form of event to the log test log test would process those events apply the filters if necessary as per the configuration then Logstash would send the details to the Elasticsearch and Elasticsearch would store those details or event in the index and all those details would be displayed in the Kivana. Kivana is the UI application which would display metrics collected by the metric beat. We would see the demo of this in upcoming sessions. But for now, I mean, it should be clear that where we are going to use metric beat in the data pipeline or in our application. Just to mention, there would be pipeline, data pipeline, where you would see that metric beat is directly sending the data to the Elasticsearch. There is no component of log test. So that depends on the requirement. You can also send the details directly to the Elasticsearch. So the log is basically the processing element in the data pipeline which would process the event, will transform the event, will apply the filters as per the requirement. If you think that your application does not need the log stand, then we can skip this log test. We can directly send the details from metric beat to Elasticsearch. Let's see a few important terms which we will come across while working on metric beat. First is metric. So what is metric? Metric is a parameter or the characteristic which will tell us about the system health or the system performance. For example, CPU uses. So CPU uses is one of the metric of CPU. CPU idle time, CPU IO bit time. These are the different metrics of CPU. Memory will have a different metric. The disk will have a different metric. Metric is a parameter or characteristic of the system which will tell you how your system is performing now metric set so metric set is the collection of different metrics for example cpu cpu is one of the metric set disk is one of the metric set memory is one of the metric set so under cpu metric set we will have a different metrics related to cpu for example cpu uses cpu idle time cpu io bit time these are the different metrics of cpu now module in metric beat we have a different modules for different purpose for example we have a system module to collect the metrics of the system like cpu memory disk process for different services we have a different modules for example apache if you want to monitor the apache service we have a apache module if you want to monitor the mysql process or service then we have a mysql module as i mentioned to monitor the 
infra infrastructure how your server is behaving what is the cpu utilization what is the memory utilization we have a dedicated module called system all these module we are going to see in our upcoming sessions and every module will have own metric sets for example if we talk about system so cpu is one of the metric set of system module disk memory these are the different metric set of system module so one module can have a more than one metric set system module having 10 to 15 metric set let me draw one diagram here you have metric beat i am using mb for metric beat as i mentioned metric beat is having different different modules so in metric beat 8.8 .8, we are having more than 40 modules so i am giving name like mode 1 to mode and we can say so metric beat having different modules each module will have a different metric set i am using ms for metric set metric set m1 metric set 2 so different different metric set so the hierarchy would be same for other modules as well and every metric set will have a own matrix so let's give name m1 m2 m3 dot 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 now let me take one practical example so here we have metric beat mb metric beat having modules like system and the apache there are many modules apache mysql so these are the different different modules and the system module having own metric set for example cpu cpu is one of the metric set of system the memory the disk the process so these are the different metric set offered by system and each metric set having own matrix for example cpu cpu having cpu uj's time cpu ideal time cpu io bit time so these are the different matrix of cpu matrix set now you can understand the relation of all these terms and it will be easy to remember for more details you can follow the official documentation of metric beat here i have already opened you can see metric beat reference and the website is elastic.co so here you can see the version so select the version which you are using so suppose you want to see the modules here you can see the link for modules click on it and and you can see all the modules of metric beat 8.8 .8. so here you can see the system module also system module click on it and you can see the metric set offered by system module you can see these are the different metric set cpu disk io core let's see the matrix of one of the metric set click on cpu you can see the matrix of this cpu metric set here the idle time io bit you can refer this official documentation let's move further now let's see the output supported by metric beat so metric beat can send the data to elastic search service it can send the data to elastic search it can send it to logstash kafka redis file system and console so as per our requirement we can use any one of the output mentioned here one thing we need to keep in mind that here i have also mentioned in the note only a single output can be used at a time we cannot use more than one output in the configuration file or we cannot configure more than one output in the metric beat configuration file in case we want to see what 
what is the data being sent by the metric bit we can use the console output when we use the console output the metric bit will print the data on the console so that we can see what is being sent by the metric bit now let's see how metric bit works i have drawn one small diagram here you can see metric bit is running inside the system it could be a container also this metric bit collects the system matrix periodically and send those matrix or data as an event to the configured output what could be the output output could be log stats kafka elastic search so any output which is supported by the metric bit in the previous slide i have mentioned all the supported output by the metric bit by default the polling period is 10 second means every 10 second metric bit collects the data of the system but we can configure this we can configure as per our requirement one thing you need to keep in mind is metric bit should be running or should be installed in the system for which you want to do the monitoring metric bit cannot collect the matrix or data remotely so metric bit should be running in the system for which you want to perform the monitoring as i mentioned in the previous slide that metric bit contains different modules like for the system to collect the system matrix cpu utilization io bit time memory utilization we will have to enable the system module first so in the configuration file we will have to enable the system module first once we enable the system module metric bit can collect the system related matrix as per our requirement we can enable the different different modules for example if you want to collect the data about apache service or apache process then you can module you can enable the apache module in the metric bit configuration file if you want to collect the data related to mysql service then you can in that case you will have to enable the mysql module in the configuration file so we will have to enable the module first then only metric bit will perform the collection of the matrix related to the, that module and i also mentioned that every syst every module having own matrix like system having cpu utilization io bit time memory utilization apache having different matrix set mysql having different matrix set in next session we will have a demo where i will show how to configure the metric bit how to collect the system data and how to send the data to the console this is all on the metric bit working thanks for watching see you in the next video